fishing today. Today we're out here on Lake Comanche. It's been a while. I've been out fishing. I haven't been catching too much fish, so we're out here at Comanche today. It's the second time here I've been here. Came about two weeks ago and I only caught about three fish, so didn't really make a video. But today we're just gonna try out this new fish finder. Got a Elite TI-9 on Black Friday, so we're gonna play with that a bit and see if we can get something dialed in and see if we catch any fish in the process. Just wanna say thanks to, uh, for you guys for getting me over 100 subs now, so appreciate that. Hopefully we can put a video together. Got some fish jumping around us, probably trout, but I'm just gonna try and mess with this fish finder and see if we can catch them in the process. Stay tuned. Try this umbrella rig for the first time. I don't really know what I'm doing with this. Come on, fishies. There has to be something on this point. Looks too good. First A rig out of the way. Got the first A rig fish out of the way. Got the first fish on the new fish finder out of the way. I'm not seeing anything on the graph right now. Huh? Yeah, first day rig fish, guys. That's what I'm talking about. First fish on the A rig. Oh. Yeah, buddy. Check that out, guys. Which one did he hook himself with? The middle one, like they say on tactical bassin. I don't know nothing about a rig fishing, but just got some swim heads, some swim jig heads I had. Put a couple ones. Only three hooks in California, so yeah, it's not a bad one. To start the first a rig fish, we'll take that all day. All right, guys, there it is. First a rig fish, a little 14 and three quarter. Thank you, buddy. Well, glad I got that one out of the way. First Alabama rig, umbrella rig, out of the way. Got them on the middle one. Middle swim bait, so. Let's chuck back in there and see. He kind of got it when I was almost at the kayak, so. Must have followed it. Just blind casting this lake point right here. Let's see if there's another one. Throwing that on my big swim bait rod. 50 pound braid to 20 pound mono. Seemed to handle them all right. Felt pretty big, but you're fishing with big equipment. Any fish is gonna feel big, I guess. I'm just gonna keep hitting these main lake points and see if we can get some few more. Buy a Huddleston here pretty soon and we're gonna start chucking that around. That's a goal for me this year is to break the PB, which is still six pounds. And hopefully do it on a Huddleston. That's why I bought this rod and reel right here. So hopefully we can do that here pretty soon as well. Yeah, buddy. Oh, oh my God. Oh. No. <laughs> I think I had two of them. I'm almost pretty sure I had two of them at one point. Woo. Man, he 
was pulling hard. It's a hard bike. That time I let it sink a little bit more to the bottom. It was a small E2. So far I'm pretty happy with this fish finder. It's a lot bigger. Touch screen. I got a side scan. The fish reveal is pretty cool. I just, I might need a new battery. We're testing the battery today too. Got a Dakota Lithium 10 amp right now. So we're going to see how long that'll run this. I have the brightness up almost all the way up I believe. So we're going to run it pretty hard today and see what I can get. So if I do have to upgrade, I can get an idea of how many more amps I should get. Probably thinking I might just get an 18 amp. That way I can hook up some lights to my kayak as well. He was deep, he was in about 47 feet of water. It's a largey. Alright, there's another one. He's chunky, he's been eating, man. Look at that tummy on him. A little 13 and a half inch here, but we'll take him. See you, buddy. See him on the graph. Swam all the way back down, huh? Right. The switch to hologram shad worked. Let's see if we can pull another one out of there. They're pretty deep. 47 feet of water. Missed it though. Hmm. Which one did they bite? The middle one again? Dang man. That must have been small. I'm seeing a bunch of stuff like that. 100 feet of water. So we're gonna try and drop in there and see what it is. Maybe it's a trout. I'm kind of need to catch something, so we're gonna just go for it. Right there. Oh yeah, there's a lot of stuff right there. I don't know what all that stuff is. But... Oh, no way. I got one on the way up. That's crazy. Whatever I have hooked is deep. What is this? Is it a fish or no? What in the hell is this? Um. Okay. Well, I hooked a... What is that, a marker buoy? I got all excited. I thought I hooked the fish really deep, but what the heck is this? How the heck am I going to get this without flipping myself over? That's not creepy at all.
Now the question is, do I want to pull this up and see what's on the other end of it? Kind of scared. I don't know how the heck I hooked that. I thought I had a little freaking trout or something. Let's see if I can pull this or not. It's probably an anchor. Oh, it was really heavy. Oh, we're gonna take this back to shore. and see if we can pull it up. I'm just praying there's not a body on the end of this thing. Wouldn't that be something? Oh, it's freaking heavy. It's taking forever to get over there. This thing is heavy, whatever it is. Oh. I can't believe I caught this thing. 100 feet of water. On 10 pound braid and eight pound fluorocarbon. It might be an anchor. Oh my god, what in the f this f man. Ugh. Oh, the end is near. How did I pull up an anchor? Oh. Can someone please explain that to me. How? Oh. How did I pull that up? Uh. It's a hundred feet of water. I saw a bunch of fish down there. I thought maybe they'd be trout, so I dropped on them. And instead I catch this. Well, that's the catch of the day right there, huh? Freaking arm workout for the day. <sighs> now let's catch a fish. All that worker deserves a fish, man. <clears throat> I can broke a sweat. I don't know if it's from being tired or being nervous. Them up, look at that. And one feet right here. And it's about time. <clears throat> I didn't even have them pinned very good either. 
Oh, 13 and a quarter. Fish number three for the day. These fish are chunky. See ya. Some right there. Man, when they're, when they're ready to bite, they're biting, man. screen they're right at the bottom just plain dumb it's a little bit nicer one long longer but skinnier okay there's another quick one see I'm telling you there's when that bite window turns on you gotta get them Let's see if we can pull another one real quick and we'll have ourselves a limit for the day took a while but limit at the end of the day rather than none at all so let's keep grinding well, everybody that's gonna do it for today's video thanks for watching if you made it this far uh, pretty much uh ended up with four fish for the day five if you count the one i lost in the kayak one came on the a rig i lost one on the a rig and then <clears throat> three came on the drop shot so yeah that's pretty much it um, about the first a rig fish out of the way so plain wasn't a good day wasn't a great day wasn't a bad day but we'll take it for being winter time fishing or late fall whatever you want to call it but the bite's been tough lately so i'm just happy i was able to get out here and try out the new fish finder and catch some fish so thanks for watching and if you like the video drop a like subscribe if you haven't and see you next time